Workforce Solutions Texoma serves an area of three counties in North Texas. The Texoma Workforce Development Region is an area of rapid growth that has experienced full employment for over two years. Healthcare and manufacturing are the top two industry clusters and both continue to show signs of growth. Seven hospitals and numerous clinics are located in Texoma, employing over 13,000 workers. Texoma Medical Center has recently enlarged their Denison campus, adding 32 emergency rooms, 32 specialty rooms, and four floors with 76 additional beds. The Denison campus is also home to a professional building, Reba's Ranch House, and several clinics. Manufacturing plants employ over 10,000 workers. Texoma is home to several award-winning companies such as Champion Coolers, Emerson, and Denison Industries. With low unemployment during the past three years, local manufacturers formed the Advanced Manufacturing Consortium to address the worker shortage. 42 students are currently enrolled in the program, which boasts free tuition and two certifications for high school students. The Advanced Manufacturing Program has widespread support from local industry, the local community college, and economic development. Texas Workforce Commission has supported this project with two equipment grants that allowed the consortium to access matching grants for a total of $400,000. Matching funds were provided by local economic developers and employers. The new $1.4 million Advanced Manufacturing Lab at Grayson College opened January 19th to celebrate the dream and showcase the new equipment. The latest news in Texoma was the announcement of Finisar, a primary supplier of Vixels for iPhones. Apple has invested $389 million in the 700,000 square foot building recently purchased by Finisar. Plans include hiring 550 workers by the end of 2018. The first new reservoir in Texas in 30 years will begin construction in Fannin County this year. With the lowest unemployment rate in Texoma, Fannin County is about to see a huge increase in worker demand. Local officials estimate construction of the $1.2 billion Lower Bodart Creek Reservoir will take five years, requiring hundreds of workers. As the reservoir is completed, there will be many new businesses springing up around the lake, and the population of Fannin County is expected to double in the next 30 years. Cook County is home to manufacturers supporting wind energy, oil and gas, and the aircraft industry. Several companies have recently expanded and others have plans in the near future. North Central Texas College works closely with Workforce Solutions to offer training to support our employers. Housing shortages are critical in all three counties as new businesses are locating in Texoma and others are expanding. New developments are being planned in all three counties. It's a great time to live and work in Texoma.